Hello guys, we're back for episode 2 of Roland's Magical Adventures. Gonna go with Hadval down to the town of Riverwood and maybe hit Whiteland too. Maybe begin the Bleak Falls Barrow. Listen, we should go to Solitude and join up with the Imperial Legion. We could really use someone like you. If the rebels have themselves a dragon, General Tullius is the only one who can stop them. So let's get on the road and head down. I hopefully figured out what was causing the storm cloaks to not wear clothes See that blue and fixed it. But if not, we're just gonna continue on with the nudist storm cloaks. If you, as you can see, I do have a mod that adds bandoliers. Sure, we can eventually find those and equip those as well to give us extra storage capacity. Oh, we have the warrior stone, which of course we're going to pick the warrior stone because these are the guardian stones. We know what we're doing. Three of the thirteen ancient standing stones that dot Skyrim's landscape. Warrior, good. I knew you shouldn't have been on that cult the minute I laid eyes on you. This game still looks good after all these years. I won't lie, I mean, look at the landscapes. That's just... This is a beautiful scene to look at. And I think Roland thinks the same. This even though it's intimidating that barrel but get that confirmed by general Tullius just he's gonna clear keep going he's also gonna take note avoid any complications of this right? path maybe he'll check it out later adventure's name of the game as they say Storm cloaks. That'll teach you to cross me. Thank you for the help, Advar. Let's get these pelts and see what we can do with. Maybe we can sell them. You have helped a lot, Advar. Uh, albeit your political stance and who you fight for, I cannot belay the I'm fact that you decided you to come with me. Uh, I am glad I came with you too, Hadvar. You have a good, a good swinging arm. We may live out. Are those the walls of the town? That's it. What if people attack? How do you defend yourself? I don't see any guards watching the wall. How absurd. Much unlike where I come from. Things look quiet enough here. Come on, where's Who did my you? Uncle? Your uncle. Your uncle runs the forge, I huh? Well, that could be useful. Having uncle a contact Hadvar. with Hello. Smith Tools certainly would come in what handy. What are you doing here? Are you on leave from Shores, Bones? What happened to you, boy? Shh, are you in uncle, some kind please. of trouble? Keep your voice down. I'm fine. But we should go inside to talk. What's going on? And who's this? He's a friend. Saved my life, in fact. Come on, I'll explain everything, but we need to go inside. Okay, okay, come inside then. Sigrid will get you something to eat, and you can tell me all about it. A dragon! I saw a dragon! I mean, you could what? just is it walk Ain't every day we get visitors on the path, you two. But I mean, be my guest if you want to walk in the sun, I assume.
Sigrid, we have company. Take a seat, I guess. Hadvar, we've been so worried about you. Come, you two must be hungry. Sit down and I'll get you something to eat. Now then, boy, what's the big mystery? What are you doing here looking like you lost an argument with a cave bear? I don't know where to start. You know I was assigned to General Tully as a scorn. We were stopped in Helion when we were attacked by a dragon. A dragon? That's ridiculous. You aren't drunk, are you, boy? Husband, let him tell his story. Not much more to tell. This dragon flew over and just wrecked the whole place. Mass confusion. I don't know if anyone else got out alive. Vesagus. I doubt I'd made it out myself if Intrigue. not for my friend you here. You see this? I need to get nope. back to Solitude and let them know what's what? happened. What? What? I thought Never you could mind. help us out. Food, supplies, a place to stay. It's of course. Still Any going. friend of Hadvar's is a friend of mine. I'm glad to help however I can. Like I said, I'm glad to help in any way I can. But I need your help. We need your help. Oh. Um. Yeah, I'll take the potions will come in handy, as with the lockpick. I... Uh, I could take the beef. The bread. I could use the ale after what happened earlier today. Uh, the ingot might come in handy as well. Thank you for your generosity. The Jarl of needs to know if there's a dragon on the loose. Riverwood is defenseless. We need to get word to Jarl Balgraf in Whiterun to send whatever soldiers he can. If you'll do that for me, I'll be in your debt. How do I get to right one from here? Cross the river and then head north. You'll see it just past the falls. When you get to White Run, just keep going up. When you get to the top of the hill, you're at Dragon's Reach, the Jarl's Palace. Uh, what can you tell me about this uh, Jarl figure, Alva? Jarl Balgraf? He rules White Run Hold. A good man, perhaps a bit overcautious, but these are dangerous times. So far, he's managed to stay out of the war. I'm afraid it can't last, though. Which side of the war does he favor? I don't think he likes either Ulfric or Ellis as much. Who can blame him? But I've no doubt he'll prove loyal to the Empire in the end. He's no traitor. Uh, who's Ellis? Ah, I forget you're new to Skyrim. Jarl Ellis, I should say. Although only because she was married to Jarl Torig when he was murdered. Ulfric murdered Torig, you know. Walked right into his palace in solitude and killed him. Shouted him to death, if you believe the stories. That's what started this whole war. The Empire couldn't ignore that. The, the egg. Once the Jarls start it's killing each other, doing a thing again. Back is, to the is there a live days. chicken in there? What can you tell me about Riverwood, Alva, aside from the uh, magical eggs? Gerda's family first settled here as woodcutters a few generations ago. She and Hod run the mill. I make a decent living sharpening axes and fixing the sawmill. It's doing it again. It scares me, Alva. What is in your eggs? Do you have any other supplies I could perhaps uh, take off your hands? Like I said, I'm glad to help in any way I can. No. Help yourself to. I apologize. I. I. Did you really see a dragon? What did it look like? Did it have big teeth? Hush, well, child. I Don't pester your cousin. You two make yourselves at home. Thank you. Um, for I should. It's nice to be back in a friendly spot, huh? Listen, I'm going to lay up here for a while. You can make your own way to Solitude from here. Who are those? I'd recommend heading to Whiterun, just down the road from here. 
From there you can take a carriage to Solitude. Who were those other prisoners? Well, you didn't know? That was Ulfric Stormcloak and his top lieutenants. I... I'm not from... I'm not from Skyrim. Is he a traitor of some kind? Right. The leader of the Stormcloaks. They claim to be fighting for Skyrim's freedom. But the war is really all about Ulfric wanting to be High King of Skyrim. If he is the leader of this faction of dissenters, how did you capture him? A masterstroke by General Tullius. He's only been in charge here for a few months, but he's turned things around for the Empire. We've been trying to catch Ulfric since the war started, but he always seemed to slip through our fingers, like he knew we were coming. This time, the General turned the tables on him. Ulfric rode right into our ambush with only a few bodyguards. He surrendered pretty meekly, too. So much for his death or glory reputation. I thought we were taking Ulfric back to Cyrodiil, but I guess the General changed his mind. You know the rest. I thought the dragons, from the tales, you know, um, Akatosh and Yutong, Dragon God and all, but that's about all I know. So did I. If the damn Stormcloak somehow found one, or woke it up, the war might be about to take an ugly turn. Hard to believe it was just a coincidence, that the first dragon anyone's seen for centuries attacks just as Ulfric was about to be executed. Do you really think I should join up with the, um, the, the dogs that are the Imperial Legion, the, um, the Thalmar's pet puppy? Of course. I know today wasn't the best introduction to the Legion, but I hope you'll give us another chance. The Legion could really use someone like you, especially now. And if the rebels have themselves a dragon, General Tullius is the only one who can stop them. General Tullius ordered my execution. Why should I want to help him, Hadgar? I don't blame you for being angry about it. I would be too in your shoes. But it was all a mistake. You weren't supposed to be on that cart with those Stormcloak traitors. And the Imperial Legion needs your help. Especially now, with that dragon out there somewhere, and Ulfric back on the loose. I... I'll have to think about it, Hadvar. You are a good man, and I trust your judgment. But I have my own reservations about the Legion. I will do no more right now about it, but I will have a good think. Sure, I understand. It's not easy to go from being executed by the Legion one day to joining up the next. But I think you'll see that the Legion is Skyrim's only hope for real peace right now. I know you'll make the right choice in the end. You lost? A good day, Hadva. Well, I need to get to White Run now. But I will. Oh, the Riverwood Trader. Hello? Well, one of us has to do something. I said no. No adventures, no theatrics, no thief chasing. Well, what are you going to do then, huh? Let's hear it. <coughs> we are Excuse done talking me. about this. Oh, <coughs> a customer. <laughs> Sorry you had to hear that. I assume you go to the proprietor. I don't know what you overheard, but the Riverwood Trader is still open. Feel Something free to shop. Something happened. Uh, yeah, we, we did have a bit of a, a break-in. We, we still have plenty to sell. Robbers were only after one thing. An ornament. Solid gold in the shape of a dragon's claw. I guess. As I'm already down to Riverwood, if I run into some bandits, I might... A chance help you you could I've got some coin coming in from my last shipment it's yours if you bring my claw back now if you're going to get those thieves you should head to bleak falls barrow northeast of town I'm about to go to the barrow yes so now you don't have to go do you oh really well I think your new helper here needs a guide uh, no I by the eight fine but only to the edge of town 
I'm not the dawn of my own. The sooner you find the claw, the sooner our lives can get back to normal. I, I, I did not agree to go to the barrel of our nards and how. Our, whatever. What do you have for sale? Take a look. Mind if I sell you some things I'm not using? I've got these. I've got a bow I don't need. Um, I don't need this quill to be taken for anything. Fine, also, do you not have this? I don't need it. I. Oh, yes, the venom. I don't need these vials, but I'm sure you could sell them to some kind of. Oh, this cell tome. I'm not a um, magic user, but I'm sure you could sell it to a wandering mage. It looks pretty advanced to me, that is. What do you have, uh, for all chance? Any sword that would be better for my... I wish I could afford a blade of steel. How much is it? 140 gold. How much would you take me on? No. No, not enough. But, if you took the bow and the sword, could you reach an agreement as well? Yes. So be it. Take the sword, take the bow, and... I will take your steel sword. Oh, good day, Luke. Time. We have to go through town and across the bridge to get to Falls Barrow. You can time to equip this new sword of ours. Yes. From here, though, the mountain just over the buildings. Those thieves must be mad hiding out there. Let us Those old crypts are filled with nothing but traps, town. trolls, and who knows what else. You are Camilla, if I heard correctly, yes? Hello, sir. Chicken from a magical egg, I presume. I could get better gloves. It would be nice. These forms are I wonder why they only stole Lucan's golden claw. I mean, we have plenty of things in the shop that are worth just as much coin. I Lucan found the claw about sure a year after he opened the store. He never quite explained where he got it. He's a tricky one. The, um, sword cost a fortune. <laughs> the age of town, he said, not to go past. You should not disobey or at least take caution to his warning I assure he looks out for your safety for a reason this is the bridge out of town the path up the mountain to the northwest leads to bleak falls barrow I guess I should get back to that my brother cold. he'll throw a fit if I take too long <laughs> such a child oh I'm going to enjoy this well I should Probably, uh, I should probably take a night at the inn. Don't want to be traveling late. I could do with a snack or two. Let's get up there. I believe I saw the inside of this building. Yes. To the sleeping giant inn. I let us go. Orgnar. Orgnar, are you listening? Hard not to. The ale is going bad. We need to get a new batch. Did you hear me? <laughs> yep, ale's going bad. I guess you don't have potatoes in your ears after all. Just make sure we get a fresh batch in soon. We got rooms and food. Drink, too. I cook. Ain't much else to tell. I see. I'm looking for work. Do you got any leads? Here, take a look at this. Some of the Jarl's men came by and left this bounty Give me letter. A mug of ale. Hmm. Coming right up. 
Ma'am, I forgive my um, trespass around the corner, but I wish you're that visitor, Ben. P what does this look like? The Temple of Mara? No ah. gold, no bed. The oh, corn stores geez. are getting low again, Ognar. Yep. My home and sick. leave. You'll take care of it? Don't I always? I don't suppose I could convince you to take care of it now, could I? No. I should have guessed. I am certain it then. This ale I will have too. Ah, but it's this board. You know what they say: no west for the weary. Let's get going, then. Don't have time to waste if there's a dragon about. I guess walking for the night is what I will do. Well then, off to right one. Let us travel across the wasteland or the wilderness. Practically the same in my opinion, but nonetheless we shall go. At least they have the standards of lamp posts to Light the way, keep the bandits away. I can get behind that kind of development. Perhaps it's not a land of renegades and barbarians as I thought it once was. Perhaps there is some civil. Dear Lord, forget what I have said. <coughs> it is a lowly place with wolves in the wilderness behind every stinking tree. How does it have? Septums. Septums. How did it get septums? Was it buying ale? No, but I will skin the pelt. Distasteful. They give wolves paychecks. What to be a wolf? If I got a paycheck to be a wolf, I'd be doing just fine. Imperials. I am wearing imperial army armor. I you should sneak by them. Head down the cliff. It is. It is safer. Running into a skirmish with soldiers of the Empire. I don't think I could best them. They are trained soldiers, after all. I am just a lowly mercenary. They could use help. Get off the oh well. Must have run off. You look strong. Come to your Basker and be a companion. You okay? You're just kind of standing there with a torch. You handle yourself well. You could make for a decent shield, brother. Shield? What? What is this? What? An outsider, eh? Never heard of the companions? An order of warriors. We are brothers and sisters in honor. And we show up to solve problems if the coin is good enough. So, you know what? I. Are you recruiting? Not for me to say. You'll have to talk to Codlack Whitemane up in Dravaskar. The old man's got a good sense for people. He can look in your eyes and tell your worth. If you go to him, good luck. Thank you for the vote of confidence, lady. Fight with us, and you'll have stories to tell. Come up to your Let us keep going. 
Wow, I still have to go to the... I assume that's the castle. Dragon... Three Dragon's Reach. Yes, that's what it was. By Izmir, it's true. A jester, funny suit and all. Just north by the Loria's farm. Fool had a coffin and a cart with a broken wheel. I'd like to see him laugh his a way out. A jester. Huh. I see. Well, they are. Uh, look to be the guard are active, so I should be safe at least in this town. They're called again right run of a town. The city, a proper city with crumbling walls. How elegant. Halt! City's closed with the dragons about. Official business only. The Riverwood calls for the Jarl's aid. Riverwood's in danger too? You better go on in. You'll find the Jarl in Dragon's Reach at the top of the hill. Thank you, Guardsman. They say Helgen got hit by a dragon. One of those horrors comes here. We'll be ready. I do have the Open City Skyrim mod, so. We'll pay no whatever it takes, but we must have more swords for the Imperial soldiers. I just can't fill an order. More Imperial propaganda. Ah. To the castle, then, yes. Guardsman. The shrine to Tal. Wasn't Talos worship outlawed by the damn Thalmor in this country? Must have. Inclined to side with the storm cloaks of their job is to banish the foul mall. Anything's better than them. Dragon's Reach. The um castle, I believe, yes. Let us be on our way. Please, you have to listen. If the news from what would you have true. what's oh. the meaning well, of this interruption? Hello. Y'all Balgoth is not Please. receiving visitors. Alva no sent me. Action. Riverwood is in I danger. Have house call. My job is to deal with all I dangers that threaten the Yarl or his people. Who's this then? So you have my attention. A now dragon explain has yourself. Destroyed Helgen. You know about Helgen? The Yarl will want to speak to you personally. So Approach. you were at Helgen. You saw this dragon with your own eyes? Yes, I had a great view while the Imperial was trying to cut off my head, so y'all. Really? You're certainly forthright about your criminal past. But it's none of my concern who the Imperials want to execute, especially now. What I want to know is, what exactly happened at Helgen? The Imperials were about to execute Ulfric Stormcloak. Well, that was again, the dragon Attacked. It rained meteors from the sky. It, it breathed molten fire. It, the fire melted brick and stone. We were forced underground to a cave. There were spiders and bears and me and a man had vow. We bravely escaped and adventured with our glory. Hmm. I should have guessed Ulfric would be mixed up in this... What do you say now, Proventus? Shall we continue to trust in the strength of our walls? Cosman. Against the dragon? My lord, we should send troops to Riverwood at once. It's in the most immediate danger. If the that dragon is lurking in the mountains... That is a provocation. He'll assume we're preparing to join Ulfric's side and attack him. We should Enough. not... Enough! I'll innocence. not stand idly by while a dragon burns my hold and slaughters my people. Irileth. Send a detachment to Riverwood at once. Yes, my Jarl. If you'll excuse me, I'll return to my duties. Well done. You sought me out on your own initiative. You've done Whiterun a service, and I won't forget it. Here, take this as a small token of my esteem. Thank you, my liege. There is another thing you could... Come, let's go find Faringar, my court wizard. He's been looking into a matter related to these dragons and rumors of dragons. Thank you. 
hope. Started to mail people, protect against arrow shots to the back and the chest for hours. Indeed, I shall put this on. Well then, let us go to your. <laughs> nice Don't shoes. even think about it. Nice shoes. You too. Varengar, I think I've found someone who can help you with your dragon project. Go ahead and fill him in with all the details. So the Earl thinks you can be of use to me. Oh yes, he must be referring to my research into the dragons. Yes, I could use someone to fetch something for me. Well, when I say fetch, I really mean delve into a dangerous ruin Fetching in search quest. of an ancient stone tablet that How may or may not actually like. be me all right where am i going and what am i fetching Falangar? straight to the point eh no need for tedious hows and whys i like that leave those details to your betters am i right i uh learned of a certain stone tablet said to be housed in bleak falls barrow a dragon stone said to contain a map of dragon burial sites go to bleak falls barrow find this tablet no doubt interred in the main chamber and bring it to me. Simplicity itself. And anything you can tell me about this bleak falls barrow? I mean, I saw it on my way up here, but it looks incredibly dangerous. An old tomb built by the ancient Nords, perhaps dating back to the Dragon War itself. Ah, maybe you just want to know how to get there. It's near Riverwood, a miserable little village a few miles south of here. I'm sure some of the locals can point you in the right direction once you get there. And how do you know this stone tablet is in Bleak Falls Barrow, Faringa? Well, we must preserve some professional secrets, mustn't we? I have my sources. Reliable sources. Um, okay, I will... Be on my way, Faringa. Thank you for the quest. This is a priority now. Anything we can use to fight this dragon or dragons, we need it quickly, before it's too late. Of course, Jarl Balgruf. You seem to have found me an able assistant. I'm sure he will prove most useful. Succeed at this, and you'll be rewarded. White Run will be in your debt. Well then, let me check this letter we got as well. To all able-bodied men and women of White Run, the bandits located in the Silent Moons camp have been harassing, robbing, and attacking citizens and visitors. A reward will be offered to anyone who kills their leader. To prevent us having entry. Looks like we have multiple things we could do. Out of the three, two of them take us to Bleak Falls Barrow. Well, let us get off to it then, shall we?